Oh, sorry, give me one second. I'll be right. Okay. Sorry about that. Uh, my house is um, in, under construction, so there are lots of people so, you know, in and out. <laughs> oh, okay. It's fine. <laughs> this. But this is just a basic uh, layer. Of the, mm -hmm. you know you know to make the real black you know one time is really hard so we're gonna and with this basic layer you can just make a plan of where are going to be the dark area like that mm -hmm. and then now you can choose um two ways um to make the real black color, you can just to keep using charcoal, the compressed charcoal, or you can use uh, the pastel, the black. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. This time I'm gonna use black pastel. Yeah, there we go. So it's extremely dark. So let me just show you the easiest way to make the color and the white in your drawing. So first, I need you to fill all the black color really dark like this. And that's from the pastels? Yes, this is the pastel. See, it's okay. <laughs> extremely dark. Yeah. yeah so the divine charcoal plays a role like the you know, sketch in your drawing because your drawing is so dark. So um, mm -hmm. that kind of thing. And uh, no, Joshua is not here because he's using the same technique. Okay, so Joshua, if you are watching this uh, recording, I need you to use this technique, same as the uh, Daniel's one. Uh, that Daniel S one. So, um, so now let's just say um, we've already filled all the black color here. And then, Professor, what about the texture? Because on the um, in the um picture, there's like a lot of texture on the box. That's right. So we're gonna make it. Okay. Yeah, so first I need you to fill all the black first, the large areas of the black like this. Mm -hmm. And so now is fun part. So now you can just use the colors of the pastel and then draw the line on it like this. So there are two ways. So you can just apply the color on the black shading. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Or so like this. Mm -hmm. And um, this is the most simplest way. And yeah. 
there is uh, another way. So with the eraser, so make your eraser sharp because since your um, image has lots of thin lines, mm -hmm. erase, so make a white line where you want to make color. Like this. And then you can add the color here. Then you can make a little bit more solid and bright color. Like mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So this is pretty much easy and simple. Yes. Mm -hmm. And the texture. So with the just white um, pastel, you can just make some dots. Like that. Mm -hmm. Pretty much simple, right? Yes. Yes. Any other question? No, that's pretty much it. Mm -hmm. I think so. So I think that you can do it. It's very easy, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So let me go back to others. Jonathan, how's it going? Uh, it's good so far. I'm working on the sketch. Okay, can I see it? I guess okay, you can be done with that. Jonathan? Sorry, hello. Can I see your sketch? You can just show it to me through the camera quickly. Yep. Ah, all right. Very good. Very good. So uh, why don't you add a little bit more details? Now, because uh, I saw in your picture, let's see. Yeah, but that's why I'm trying to outline the alphas. Yes, yes, the, the inside things, you know, I, I guess, I think these are pretty much interesting in your image. So I need you to sketch all of the details in it, okay? Okay. All right. Thank you for sharing. Call. Call, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Sorry. Um, so, call. Um, yeah, can you just show me your work process through the camera? I'm, go I'm going to just quickly glance at. Oh, very good. Oh, yes, you have lots of details. You know what, Cole, you don't need to draw everything. You know, remember, this is an abstract drawing. You, know, you don't need to draw anything realistic. So make it simple and make it just a symbolized. Now, um, don't make it too much complicated. You know, it takes a long time. And, and um, uh, actually you have to finish your work today. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Because the, the sketch was the um, last week's homework, actually. So um, I need to hurry up and do not okay. make it too much complicated and make it very simple, okay? You can just keep um, the drawing you've already did on your you know, Bristol board. You can just keep it. And then the rest of the part, I need to make it simple and you know, not too complicated, okay? Professor? Yes, Martin. It will be the last. Uh, you need to submit today the final work. Yes. Okay. Today is the due date. Uh, since it's an abstract drawing, it doesn't take that long. You know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like you see, you know, the demonstration I showed you uh, for the Daniela. You can just make it extremely simple, and it doesn't take that long to finish the coloring. So, okay, okay. Yeah. So I need you to 
um, finish it oh, yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm, by today. Okay. And um, uh, we're going to move on to the next project, uh, the figurative drawing tomorrow. Uh, wait a minute. So, Professor, abstract drawings are drawings that are simple, but they look complicated? Um, actually, it's not really, you know, it doesn't look that complicated. Maybe it looks complicated, but it's not really, no. Uh, yeah. It can be just, you know, um, consist of the colors and the simple shapes. So it can be pretty much simple. Mm -hmm. so I need you to, you know, not to take too much time to finish your work. Okay. All right. All right. Um, everyone, again, this project should be finished by today. And uh, please post to your final work uh, in 6.1. And uh, we have just two uh, more weeks left. Um, so um, we have um, two more works um, uh, until the end of the course. Uh, so uh, how many classes we have? Um, it's seven sessions left. So. Uh, from tomorrow and until uh, this Thursday, we're gonna finish the uh, figurative drawing. And the next week, the last week, uh, we're gonna make a, a self, uh, self portrait drawing for the last project. So um, let's just um, say uh, the figurative drawing uh, we, what we are, that we are going to do tomorrow first. Uh, so tomorrow we're going to do um, croquis uh, during the meeting and then um, you're going to make a, a simple uh, abstract or realistic figurative drawing um, for the rest of this week and uh, next week again uh, for the last project we're going to make a self-portrait drawing and that project is going to be um, provide you four days, uh, four days to finish. And um, um, uh, for the self portrait, you can just use any technique, any mediums we've used so far. Uh, so let, let's just talk about the self portrait next week. And uh, today you're gonna just to focus on to finish this uh, abstract drawing first. Any question? Um, if you don't have any other question, I'm gonna give you some time to finish your work uh, independently. Because you have to just you know, finish the coloring. 